here we go. This is the unboxing and review of the North Wave Ghost XTM2 cycling shoe. Okay, this is a nine and a half UK size or a 43 European size. Here we go. Right. Oh, it's difficult to undo one handed. There we are. I've got the cleats all ready to go. Let's put that down. It's a trouble trying to do everything one-handed, holding the camera. What I need is a proper tripod. There we go. Right, let me get a pair of scissors and I'll cut that off. Here we go, that's the shoe lid open. I've already taken out the padding because it's quite difficult to do one-handed and I've also cut off the instructions for the boa. Let me lift the shoe out. No, it's not too heavy. Double boa. Now these boas, if I can get a close-up of the boa, one click of the boa releases the string by one click. I'll tighten that up, you'll see. One, there it goes, it's already, already freed up. Now if I lift this up here, this allows that to undo, to give me plenty of slack. There we go, that's better on that one. You see that one click around one. Loosen that off, it gives me plenty of of uh, adjustment there, or should be I get my, my fat foot in there. But yeah, this is the top of the shoe, it says X-Frame 2. These uh, little logo, North Wave logo is reflective, saying it's reflective there. There's nothing on the heel, so if you're viewed from the rear, there's no, no reflective. But the shoe's bright yellow, and they should, people should be able to see that. Two vents to let your sweat run free and also these are little holes in the leather which just allow the, uh, the fabric underneath to breathe through. Allows the fabric to breathe through. And we just turn the shoe over. It says North Wave in the middle there. And Yes, it's carbon. You can see there's lots of, there's a, a section of carbon there. Carbon fibre material. I don't know if you can quite see that. That says 12 stiffness index. So that's 12 out of 12. I know they only go up to 12. Uh, so this is a very, very stiff mountain bike shoe, which I shall, will be using on my road bike. Uh, because I've, I've hardly ever seen any road cyclists using road cycling uh, pedals. I've only seen them use mountain bikes. There, okay, I tell a lie. There is one or two uh, road cyclists out there that use road shoes. And, and you can tell them in the cafe because they, they walk like ducks. And people say, oh yeah, well you're not supposed to. Oh well, yeah, you do put your feet on the ground. I'm sorry, but you get a puncher, or you have to make adjustments. Anyway, I'm digressing, ranting on. And I've, I've got myself some genuine Shimano cleats, which I shall put on 
at another date you see my other video yeah let's get the other one out there we go the sun's coming out oh told it it's very difficult to pull these things out with one hand crikey if only we had three hands Well, it's going to have to stay in there, I think, until I stop recording. There we go, got it out eventually. Again, carbon, it says. Index of 12. Go back to the box. What we've got in the box? We've got a little, we've got a North Wave. Uh, leaflet that tells you all about it. It says do not machine wash or pressure wash and do not put them in direct sunlight. Oh dear. What happens when we go outside? We're in direct sunlight. Anyway, I digress slightly. Um, yeah, just seeing what the torque levels, torque settings are. I'll have a look later and let you know. I think it's at four newton meters, if I remember correctly from... Uh, what does it say here on the Shimano packet? No, I don't really know. It doesn't really say. It, but I think four newton meters is about right. So then, in conclusion, after the uh, little unboxing, what are my impressions of the North Wave Ghost XCM2 shoe? Well, I think it's very much the same as my. Uh, original pair of shoes of a North Wave Rebel uh, except these are stiffness of 12 my North Wave Rebel was a stiffness of 11 uh, I'm pretty certain I won't be able to tell the difference uh, but yep like I said I got these in the sale the winter sale so come summertime I shall be using these um, on my road bike but the thing with um, with having mountain bike shoes on a road bike is that I can hop off on my road bike and go straight onto my mountain bike without having to change my shoes uh, and if I do forget you know take the bike out anywhere I don't have to remember to pick up the right shoes because all my shoes are the right shoes oh the box is just shut the ghost the north wave ghost has shut the box so anyway there you go The North Wave Ghost in a nice bright yellow and grey colour with black, uh, I don't know what you call it, black uh, artwork, real leather with this bit obviously rubber around the front. These feel quite uh, soft. The uh, footbed seems quite uh, stiff and this feels a bit it feels really nice the heel feels nice so we'll see we'll see so that's the unboxing and review of the ghost now if you got this far into the video just hit that like button hit the subscribe button if you want to and then once you hit the subscribe, why not hit the bell button so you get all the notifications of my upcoming videos. There you go. I do like the BOA system. And there's no... With, with laces, you have to keep tightening your laces. They come out, they get tangled. Boas, neat and secure. I like it. Anyway, enjoy. Go cycling if you can. Bye.